Yo, 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 what's up guys? So, today we're doing some pillow talk. Mm, pillows. Um, don't mind the neighbors, they're running their four-wheelers like they always do. I waited all day to film this video. It hasn't stopped. Yeah. So, <laughs> um, I saw the 60 second doc uh, where this woman created a space where people could come and pillow talk no sex, just talking and being vulnerable with a stranger. And I thought that was so cool. So I just wanted to take a second and it made me think about the word intimacy. And with Valentine's Day just passing and we're in the season, newest season of The Bachelor, I haven't been watching it. I'm okay. Not missing out. But we... A lot of the movies and whatnot that we see come out of the entertainment industry and out of Hollywood tells us that intimacy is I love you, here's some flowers, here's some chocolates, I hate you, we break up, we get back together, guys standing out in the rain, we kiss, we make up, we maybe have sex, and we live happily ever after, but the truth is that's, that's not intimacy. Intimacy is holding back someone's hair when they're puking and being for, there for them through thick and thin. It's seeing into someone truly and genuinely and meeting them where they're at and loving them wholly and fully. And yes, that is hard some days, but that's, that's what we gotta do. That's how we create empathy and compassion for others and in turn we do that for ourselves. Um, yeah, and every every human being wants to be loved and every living thing wants to be loved and if we can't love on ourselves how can we love on each other and we're ultimately called to treat others the way you want to be treated and i would go a step further to say if you're not willing to treat yourself with compassion and kindness or then how can we expect you to treat someone else or vice versa? I don't know. I'm just rambling because, you know, hello talk. Nothing scripted. <laughs> but, yeah. So, all that to say, intimacy. See into someone's life and be willing to accept and meet them where they're at. And, yeah, just be kind to one another. Demand excellence and the fact that you you deserve so much more than you're willing to let yourself have in all areas of your life not just romantic ones but in your job in your personal life in your finances everything you can achieve so much more than you believe and with that keep living your truth and have a blessed day bye <laughs>